Hello, my name is Philip, and I'm a developer here with Ashley Audio. In this video, we're going to cover exporting your design files from your Ashley Remote app on your iPad. This simply means we're going to be transferring the design files from our iPad and putting them on our computer. Once they're located on our computer, they'll be available for importing into other iPads. To follow along with me today, you'll need five things. You'll need to save your design on your iPad. You'll need to free up a USB jack on your computer. You'll need to install iTunes on your computer. You'll need the USB charge cable that came with your iPad. And you'll need your iPad. Now we already have our iPad connected to our computer using the USB charge cable. And we, are, we also already have iTunes installed. So let's go ahead and get started. Clicking on the icon on my desktop, I can open up iTunes. Once iTunes has opened, I see the iPad icon appear at the top. Now, I already have my iPad connected, but if you don't, go ahead and connect it now um, by using your USB charge cable. Once it's connected, you should see this icon appear. So we're going to click on the icon. That takes us to a page that tells us some information about our iPad. Then at the top here, we'll see all these um, tabs. We're going to click on the Apps tab. Okay, the Apps tab page will show us all of the apps that are installed on our iPad and also apps that are linked to our account. Let's use the scroll bar to scroll down. Um, in this section we see um, Ashley Remote. We're going to click on Ashley Remote here and then this section over here will now show us all of the files that are available for exporting. Um, and so in this video we're going to show you how to export the example app. This example app comes with every install so you should have one on yours but you can go ahead and select the file that you saved your design should be in this list somewhere so to export we're going to left click on the file um, and we're gonna hold down the left mouse button and we're gonna drag our mouse off to the side and then we're gonna let go of the left mouse button and that will copy the design to the computer now if you have any other um, images that you've imported into your design uh, you may have to export those as well so that they'll be available for importing later um, but you can see on the desktop here that I have the example app now so I've done the exporting thanks for watching